There's no doubting what you've achieved on a technical level. These are clearly state of the art. There Ow. are just certain design choices that were made for these robots Holy that you don't fully understand. Fuck. We were hoping that you could shed some light on those. That was fucking loud. She can dance. She can sing. She's equipped with oh. a built-in helium tank for inflating balloons right at her fingertips. She can take song requests. She can even dispense ice cream. With all due respect, those aren't the design choices we were curious about, Mr. Afton. Jesus. Wow. What is up, ladies and gentlemen? Welcome back to the gaming channel. Here's some much more Plus V1, and we are finally on Five Nights at Freddy's sister location. That is right. We've made it to the end of the goal. The end of Halloween is now finally upon us. It is now most likely October 31st, and you are seeing this loud ass game. It's really fucking loud, oh my god. My own fault. I didn't turn down this, the actual deal on this on the computer, so I turned it on my, down on my monitor, but it's still loud as fuck. Okay, so well. Like I was saying, I've just finished up with Final Nights of Freddy's 4 and finish it. But I didn't even make it past the first night. I know I'm gonna make it past the first night on this one, due to the fucking fact that Jesus Christ, due to the fact that uh, uh, the first one's kind of easy. They tell you what to do. It's just it's all set up. So I know I'll get past the first night on this one. If I die on the fucking first night, I'm gonna be really fucking shocked. But we're gonna go as far as we can. More than likely, I'll probably get to the same night that everyone else first gets to before they die the first time, and that's all the way up to the fucking. Spring trap suit, but we'll see. We'll, we'll find out for sure because I'm not like everybody else. Again, this is the first time I've ever played this, so we're just gonna jump right into it here in three, two, one, and now. All right, put the headphone back on. She's because she's an evil bitch. That's why. Stay away from those animatronics. They're not good for you. They will kill you. They'll eat your face. Hey! Welcome to the first day of your exciting new career. Whether you were approached at a job fair, <laughs> read our ad in screws, bolts, and hairpins, or if this is the result of a dare, we welcome you. I will be your personal guide to help you get started. I'm a Model 5 of the Handyman's Robotics and Unit Repair System, but you can call me Hand Unit. Your new career promises challenge, intrigue, and endless janitorial opportunities. Please enter your name as Fuck. seen above the keypad. This cannot be changed later, so please be careful. Okay. Um. Uh. It seems that you had some trouble with the keypad. I see what you were it's trying. It's not possible to type in what you were typing. I will correct it for you. One moment. Welcome, Welcome Eggs Benedict. <laughs> Joke's on you, asshole. That's what I was trying to type in. <laughs> oh, my nose is starting to run now. Men's floor. Men's wear. Uh, two, five, six, seven, eight, nine, enter. I fucking don't know. I don't know another damn coat. You can now open the elevator using that bright, red, and obvious button. Let's get to work. Yes, let's. How do I move? Allow me to fill this somewhat frightening silence with some light-hearted banter. Due to the massive success, and even more so the unfortunate closing of Freddy Fazbear's Pizza, it was clear that the stage was set, no pun intended, for another contender in children's entertainment. Unlike most entertainment venues, our robotic entertainers are rented out for private parties during the day. And it's your job to get the robots back in proper working order before the following morning. You are now in the primary control module. It's actually a crawl space between the two front showrooms. Now, let's get started with your daily tasks. Through the window to your left. This no, is the Ballora I'm pushing back. Party room and dance oh god, that's horrible. Encouraging kids to get fit and enjoy pizza. Let's turn on the light and see if Bellora is on stage. Press the blue button on the elevated keypad to your left. 
Oh, you don't make noise. Oh, look, she's not there. What a fucking surprise. Uh oh. It looks like Ballora doesn't feel like dancing. Let's give her some motivation. Press the red button now to administer a controlled shock. Maybe Why? that will put the spring back <laughs> in the Sure, let's shock the fuck out of her. Let's check the light again. Poor Ballora. Ballora is feeling like her old self again. And no wonder she wants to rip your fucking face tomorrow. off when you meet her. Now view the window to your right. Mm -hmm. This is the Funtime Auditorium, where Funtime Foxy encourages kids to play and share. Try the light. Let's see what Funtime Foxy is up to. Okay. Nothing, she's not there. Looks like Funtime Foxy is taking the day off. Good. Let's motivate Funtime Foxy with a controlled shock. <sighs> Sorry, Foxy. <laughs> Let's try another controlled shock. Man, that's messed up. Shock of Fox, that's not nice. Be nice to your local foxes. Look at her. Looks like Funtime Foxy is in perfect working order. Great job. In front of you is another vent shaft. Crawl through it to reach the circus gallery control module. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, it's not crawling. Motion trigger. Circus gallery vent. See, everyone got jump scared on that fucking uh, On the other part. side of the glass is Circus Baby's auditorium. Let's check the light and see what Baby is up to. You can't see her at all, even when she's actually... There's a puppet. Looks like a few of the lights are out. I wouldn't say puppet. We can fix that later. Let's encourage Baby to cheer up with a controlled shock. Why is there so much crap in here? Let's try another controlled shock. Let's try another controlled shock. There she is. She's fine, she's happy. Great job, Circus Baby. We knew we could count on you. Okay, Thank so it wasn't just duties for your first night on the job. We don't want you to leave overwhelmed. Otherwise, you might not come back. No we shit. Using the vent behind you, and we'll see you again tomorrow. Hey, what? Well, I might not have time to do another fucking deal. It's already 7:52. Someone has to go bed. Have to go start rocking somebody at eight. So. What? What in the fuck was that? There we go. That's better. <laughs> My light was getting covered up by the towel. I don't have a towel. It's a pillowcase. Another day, another dramatic ah. entry in the oh, lives no, no, of no. Dad and his distressed mistress. Where will they go? What will they do? All of that and more happening now. Clara, I tell you, the baby isn't mine. Count, I tell you that it is. You're the only vampire I've ever loved. And the baby turns his bottles into powdered milk. That doesn't mean anything. He sleeps on the ceiling fan. Upright or upside down? What does it matter? You need to be part of your son's life. I'm an old man, Clara. I can't be a father. Well, then at least pay your child support, you deadbeat! Will Vlad and his distressed mistress find common ground? Tune in next time. The other children are pricks. 
Your daddy's an angel. Welcome back for another, another night of intellectual stimulation, pivotal career choices, and self-reflection on past mistakes. We're committed to creating a unique and fulfilling work experience. One part of that commitment is ensuring that you don't get tired of the voice that you're hearing right now. Using the keypad below, it seems that you had some trouble with the keypad. I see what you were trying to type, and I will auto-correct it for you. Thank you for choosing Angsty, angsty Teen. teen. <laughs> as much as I love the Angsty Teen, we're going to have to cut it here. I'll be back with this tomorrow anyway, because I want to finish it all up. Oh shit, balls. Snip, snip. <laughs> Like I was saying, we're gonna go ahead and end it here because uh, it's almost eight o'clock and it's about time for someone's bedtime. So we're gonna end this here and I'm just gonna have to come back to it until tomorrow. So Gloria, you're about to come. Um, I'm about to come. Actually, no, it's first circus babies, her little fucking baby freaks that wanna fucking kill me. They'll probably get me too. Anyway, I'm, I'm not gonna quit this one after one death. I'm gonna try and actually try and beat this one maybe. I don't know, I haven't decided yet. Again, depends on if any of these videos get a thousand likes. Uh, I know I said like 2,000 or 5,000 in episode two of the Five Nights at Freddy's first one. But I don't know. Anyway, uh, thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you liked it, go ahead and hit that thumbs up button. I greatly appreciate you. And if you have not yet, go ahead and subscribe to the channel for daily videos. And I will see you guys in the next video. So, peace.